Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle certainly this is a very very impressive venue quite a sight to behold well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this a capacity crowd here yes peter it's a shame it's only a, a friendly but then again that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Hugo Lloris. His lightning-fast reactions and all-round shot-stopping ability make him a formidable obstacle. Cristiano Ronaldo! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper, has just received an A-plus grade. Good save, he got a decent fist on that. Uh, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. He goes long. Hoists it forward, and now they can launch a counter. And it's Deli Alley. Aurier. Tottenham have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Bruno Fernandez. Good take, and it's Cavani! Goal! Manchester United! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Manchester United get themselves into the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Lo Celso tries to get it forward quickly. And here's Deli Alley. Pogba is steaming forward. He's had a look. Caught offside that time. Loris sends that a long way. Dyer. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1 0. Aurier clips one through. Big chance! No, that wasn't kidding anyone. Well, it could have been and probably should have been a, a different choice of finish. There was lower space to hit. Dyer. Ricky Long. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Dyer. Dyer drives it forward. Son Hyung Min. Cristiano Ronaldo with a delicate ball. And it's hoisted clear.
Deli Alley. Forward it goes. He's through now. Is he in? And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Reggie Long. Tottenham have a free kick. Reggie Long. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Hoip. And the whistle goes for half time. So there you have it. A close sport half of football. But one that still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Manchester United come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting. And there is certainly plenty for us to chew on during the break. And the game has already resumed here. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Away from immediate danger. And it's Pogba. Sanchez. Lo Celso. Son Hyung Min. K. K. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Tottenham grab the equaliser and we're all square. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well matched and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. Sanchez. Deli Alley. And here's Kane. Kane. Brings it forward. Varan. And he's there to cut it out. And it's Varan. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. All the balls come loose. Pogba. Aurier is there, and he can get that clear. Oh, what a ball! He's had a go! Goal! Manchester United! And they get themselves Ooh. in front! Oh, high-quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Manchester United get themselves into the lead. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. Lucas Moura. Now it's Son Hyung Min. Son Hyung Min has a goal! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Oh, real danger here! De Gea deals with it effortlessly. Fred. Cristiano Ronaldo. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Lucas Moura plays just the goal. He's had a shot! This could fall anywhere. And they've been caught out here. Now it's Lucas Moura. And it's a chance! And he's there to make a great save. Hoiberg simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. 
Tottenham are making a change now. Well, the referee's seen the board and he's going to allow a double change to go ahead now. Tottenham need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. He's got away. Up for the header! And the through ball is intercepted. Has a hit! Great effort, but no way through. And that's that. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Manchester United were very impressive here, Peter. The backbone of this team is so strong and it proved to be 